my subspecialty is female urology, uh, avoiding dysfunction in neurourology. Uh, this subspecialty, uh, as a translation, it works with uh, all avoiding dysfunction, including urinary frequency, urgency, uh, waking up at night to go to the bathroom, uh, urinary leakage, uh, associated with any of the problems uh, with uh, urinary tract, uh, such as fistula or urgency or stress. Uh, and this applies to uh, females, women, or men. Uh, the other part is pelvic floor dysfunction. Um, also, um, I work with BPH. Uh, I uh, do a lot of urethral reconstruction in men and women. Uh, the urodynamics and urourology, uh, the urodynamics is part of the uh, workup for patients with uh, voiding dysfunction. Uh, it is sophisticated that it requires some uh, experience, and uh, this is uh, where it comes, my experience. Uh, the other part, uh, neurourology, it's a difficult part uh, that uh, many physicians don't want to deal with, uh, and uh, I, uh, I'm interested in this because it helps uh, patients who have neurogenic bladder problems that can affect their quality of life and their life in some situations. Uh, it's very stressful, of course, when you are in the physician's office and then you're going to meet physicians and you're going to uh, go through uh, some private stuff in your life with them. So I try to make them uh, more familiar with me. I try to make them feel like I am part of their family. And then I start to try to uh, find out why are they in uh, my clinic. Uh, try to go into depth about the details uh, that uh, they might not uh, tell if uh, they don't feel comfortable. Um, I spend about 15-20 minutes usually with my patients if it is uh, simple, straightforward problems. If it's more complicated problems, I can spend more time with them. Um, after this, I give them a chance to uh, get ready for the exam. Uh, and then I examine them and again I give them a chance to um, collect themselves, I would say. Uh, get dressed and uh, get more comfortable and um, prepare the questions they want to ask me and I come back and uh, start exploring about uh, what did I find and what are the solutions, what are the workups. Uh, sometimes I go into more details about the uh, workup plan in the future if it is more complicated issue. If it is something simple, I just line out for them what is the next step and go from there.